The other thing CBS Sports has ranked is um, the NFL divisions strictly by the quarterbacks. And this one is kind of interesting. They rank the AFC West first. Uh, obviously, Patrick Mahomes, uh, Justin Herbert, and, and well, not to a lesser extent, Derek Carr. NFC West um, is number two. That's uh, Russell Wilson, Kyler Murray, Garoppolo. And then the AFC North is ranked third um, with, you know, Burrow, up-and-coming guy, Baker, up-and-coming guy, Lamar Jackson, which that seems a little low for the, uh, for the AFC North a little bit. You know, I think it's fair right now, actually. I think it's okay because uh, you have to kind of see how Joe Burrow comes back from his torn ACL. Um, you know, I, I, I think you could have maybe flip-flopped them and put them number two, uh, but I don't think third is is the worst spot for them, uh, in part because you just don't know what Ben Roethlisberger is going to be, and you don't know how Joe Burrow is going to come back from uh, that knee injury. Now, when he is healthy, he's dynamite, and I think he's just going to be uh, one of the great young quarterbacks to watch in this league, uh, but it might just be a year or two out. Yeah, the, the interesting thing is the way they've kind of surrounded him with weapons being the the receivers with Chase and T Higgins the question is can they keep them upright if if that line comes together um, the Bengals are going to be a problem offensively yeah that's the whole key I mean you have to protect these quarterbacks and that is a lesson that the Browns learned in part because Ryan Grigson didn't do that early enough for Andrew Luck in Indianapolis and now that he's here as a senior personnel advisor he banged the table jumped on the table uh for building that offensive line and protecting the quarterback and they have done that and it has made all the difference in the world and teams that don't do that are really going to suffer this year